Hi, this is Frank Braddis, and we're at the Red Touch Experience with our continuing series on the future of content. And I'm with Sharon Scott, who is the president of Peacock Productions. Thanks for joining us, Sharon. Great to be here. So tell me a little bit about Peacock Productions. Well, Peacock Productions has now been in existence for more than six years, which is seems like a, uh, a long time, but it hasn't been, it's not that old. Uh, we do all, at this point, all nonfiction content. We haven't gotten into scripted yet, uh, but across all genres. So what we, we have excelled at are big live events, clip shows, crime narrative, you know, mystery crime, and, and w with some level of recreation. So it's like, it, it touches on scripted to some degree. And the quick turnaround. We do that a lot. So, you know, something happens in the world and then, you know, a week later somebody wants it, we're the ones to, to turn that around. And is it likely that that's going to be a long form kind of program? Everything is long form. In fact, we have done very little short form. A lot of times what we do gets carved up, which is great, usually by the client. If they want to take, you know, individual pieces of what we've done and do something digitally with it, that's, that's wonderful. But everything that we do is long form. Is there a primary um, distribution uh, system for Peacock Productions content or is it depending on the client? Uh, totally dependent on the client. In fact, that's one of uh, our, as a production, co as a U.S.-based production company's, one of our stresses, which is pretty much everything we produce is owned by somebody else. So we have a very small library of material that has been produced inside NBCU, which we own, and then we distribute through our own company. But most of what we do is commissioned, and so therefore the Discovery Channels of the world or whomever we produce for would own it and then distribute it.